Well, it's Super Science Saturday once again, and so far so good. As you can see, the place is actually pretty packed. I'm off to go do a few experiments and maybe hold some reptiles. Super Science Saturday is in its 15th year, and it's only getting bigger. Parents and children alike love spending the day learning about math, chemistry, and animals in a very fun way. From small fun, to bigger fun, to this. And that was only one presentation. We're gonna demonstrate lightning right now. And I could feel that in my hair. There were air experiments. And we just kind of let it go up. Severe weather tips. Gloop making. And yes, reptiles. Plenty of snakes for the kids to hold, like the king snake, Burmese python, and the boa constrictor. Some of the kids look forward to this. Look at the snakes and like spiders and stuff. And some of them didn't. Uh, they kind of freaked me out. I didn't like it because I. I didn't like it I, because I didn't like snakes. Well, I can't blame them because neither do I. But for the sake of science, I thought I'd give it a try. Now all of this plays into the ultimate goal for Super Science Saturday. This topic of math and science is important because we want kids to see that it's fun. We want to get them thinking about going maybe into a career in the math or the sciences. Which is important in today's digital world. Having hands-on experiences in the math and sciences can help push us to our limits. I think they get a lot of confidence out of it. And I see them stick with something that they don't get at first until they do get it, uh, which is they don't give up. At Super Science, they don't give up as easily for whatever reason, probably because they're having a good time. For Fox 26 KNPN, I'm Jeremy Lyons.